Good evening, this is without question one of the true cathedrals of football, Anfield, the venue tonight. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you commentary, and joining me is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. We've got action from the round of 16 in the Champions League to bring you. It is Liverpool against Borussia Dortmund. Well, down to the last 16 teams, Derek, the cream normally starts to rise to the top at this stage. Big teams will start to show their hands, but I'm sure there'll still be a few upsets. Number six, Thiago. Number nine, Roberto Firmino. to discuss with you the differences between the group stage and the knockout stages did you as a player prepare differently when the round of 16 began well you don't before the game you go into every game wanting to win etc but as the group sort of takes shape you're now looking at results saying oh, a draw will do us tonight so you do start to play the game a little bit differently as the tournament goes on knockout football just get out there and win the game and this is how Liverpool start the game well, there's no great mystery, is there? We know normally how they're going to play, and it's all about applying as much pressure as possible. Lee, can we anticipate seeing more of the same today? Yeah, absolutely, Derek. If you're really good at something, then why not? They're very good at this. All the team members have bought into this style of play. One player slacks off, and it all falls apart, though. This is the lineup for Dortmund. Roman Burki begins in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Mats Hummels in central defence. Emre Chan plays alongside Axel Witzel in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And intercepted it. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Might jump in front. And there it is, the opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back and he composes himself, coolly slides it past a lonely keeper who will be asking questions about where his back four went to. Well, he's delighted, isn't he? We can see that. Calm is needed now just to consolidate this lead. Cool heads. And Liverpool come away with it. Encouraging move from Liverpool. Salah! It's still alive. And in at the second time of asking. But the goalkeeper badly at fault. Here we can take a look at it again. I'm sure the coaching staff will too. Just not good enough, you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone, and at this level, you're always going to be punished. Well, the manager must be delighted with his team after they showed that attitude to get back into this top stop. Sancho, that's not a bad ball, and a goal to re-establish their advantage, just look at the celebrations. Well, we can see it again here, what a lovely inviting cross into the danger area that was, but if a player can stand still and nod the ball into the net like that, I'll be asking serious questions about my centre-backs, shocking really.
Another live match from the Bundesliga coming up soon on EA TV. It's Borussia Dortmund against Union Berlin. Yeah, Derek, should be a great atmosphere there. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. A clear penalty and a yellow card to boot. And with play stop, they will make the change now. scope for them to counter-attack here will it be sufficiently imaginative might be a chance here as eyes for goal oh it's gone in a significant deflection leaving the keeper flummoxed Well, here we see a better angle on it. There's nothing the keeper can do. A significant deflection, and he's beaten. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek. He's not happy. Just look at him. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie. Yes, Derek, they have an advantage, but it's only a small one. There's not much between the two teams. Really good game of football. I'm really looking forward to that second leg, Derek. Well, it shouldn't come as any great surprise to hear us say this, but Jadon Sancho kept asking questions as the game progressed. Lee, interested to know what you made of his contribution. Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is. Well, this is a region that really loves its football, the industrial west of Germany. We're at the home of Borussia Dortmund. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary position as always by Lee Dixon. And it's the Champions League round of 16 second leg. It is Borussia Dortmund taking on Liverpool. Yeah, thanks Derek. Liverpool with plenty of work to do after that first leg. Not quite good enough really. They'll need a better performance tonight if they're to progress to the next round. Dortmund. Roman Burki gets the nod in goal. Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. Torgan Azar plays with Jadon Sancho out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. 
Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Oh, tremendous vision. Salah. Space and time for the cross. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Now can they create something? Holland. It's there for him. Safe but still a chance. And a corner kick. The referee's verdict. Breaking at pace with Menace. Oh, big chance! Can he find the net? And there it is! The breakthrough! That will do nicely! Well, let's look at this again. Magical football on the break. Surprise is the key. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. Jaden Sancho. And Bellingham. Will it be? Brandt. Virgil van Dijk. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defenders just not able to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here's the replay, Jerry, and the defensive coach will be all over this one. Shocking defending. There's so much time for the strikers. That can't be right. looking attack Azar real chance well that is how to nullify the opposition it's there for him and it goes the lead just gets bigger surely they can't let this slip now well here's the goal again and he's just been caught napping hasn't he and his pocket picked right in front of his schoolboy stuff. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. Can they hit on the break? Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Another goal! The lead grows to four now! A rampant display! Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely quick counter-attack that sets up the chance. And then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? absolutely smashes it past the keeper it's a really lovely finish well enjoy the good days as a coach it could be a roller coaster ride i can tell you that that's the end of the contest and borussia dortmund have progressed well, Derek, what confidence that will give him. A huge margin to go through into the next round. Played very, very well. That confidence, you can use that. You have to. It's like gold dust.
go into the next round with that confidence who knows where they can go and he put in a really thorough performance tonight Lee well he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath two goals for the lad today played superbly well looked really sharp constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender a real handful